We're excited about today. A lot of fun, uh, fun, exciting news for Bristol Motor Speedway and for this region. Um, we've got about 75 days, give or take, before you're going to see cars down there on that racetrack. And a little over 220 days, I believe it is, until we start playing some football. So uh, to share some exciting news with you today, uh, I'd like to invite my friend up, Dr. Sander. Come up. Thanks, Jerry. Uh, this is really an exciting day for ETSU. I guess a couple years ago, um, had some discussions with Jerry about the possibility of ETSU playing a game here at Bristol Motor Speedway. Um, for ETSU, you know, we thought, wow, what a, what a wonderful opportunity for us to expose our football program to give our student athletes an incredibly unique experience that that not many college football players would ever get to experience experience, plus also um, have the ability to, co to continue to build just a tremendous relationship with Bristol Motor Speedway. What better way to start SoCon football against uh, a rival that uh, has been a rival for many, many years in Western Carolina, uh, Mark Spears. I know he'd like to be here today and obviously is not a close friend of mine, the head coach there. I know we've talked about it several times and he and his team are as much excited about it as we are. Uh, that's something that our players talk about just about every day about the opportunity that this is going to bring. Obviously, it's a great, great uh, thing for us to do in recruiting. Um, how many people in America get to play in the greatest arena in the country for a football game. Thank Bristol Motor Speedway and all their staff and thank all the folks at ETSU for having us here as a part of this big announcement today. And our athletic director, Randy Eaton, and our head coach, Mark Spear, wish they could be here. If anybody has ever met Coach Spear, you know, it's killing him not to be here today. He's such a huge NASCAR fan, born and raised in Kannapolis, North Carolina, and NASCAR is a big part of uh, his life. And, and uh, He's jealous that he's not able to be here today with us with uh, the backdrop of Bristol Motor Speedway uh, here today. So uh, we want to pass along our excitement. You know, first and foremost, we're excited about East Tennessee, ETSU being back in the Southern Conference and us rekindling and renewing this football rivalry and could not think of a better or perhaps a bigger way to welcome this football rival, rekindle things with ETSU. So we're really thrilled about that here. The uh, the last great Coliseum to host uh, the first of many, many more Western Carolina ETSU football battles. Looking forward to that. Uh, and I think they know a thing or two about rivalries here uh, at Bristol Motor Speedway as well. This is going to be huge for this region as well, September the 17th. Um, putting that on. We are going to have a modified setup to kind of get into some of the details of the way we're, we will operate. Tickets will uh, go on sale. You can call now uh, the Bristol Motor Speedway ticket office and put a deposit down. Uh, tickets are going to start at $25. Kids tickets will we'll have an opportunity for children to come attend uh, for cheaper as well. It's $15 for kids uh, and for students that are from other schools. Uh, want to make that affordable for everybody. This is something that we see as a great opportunity to support uh, this great region. It's supports us so well. ETSU, they've been great partners to us for many, many years, uh, become really good friends. This is a great opportunity for us to extend and, and help them and do something to give back to the region. So uh, we are thrilled to be a part of this, and it's going to be a lot of fun for all of our team.